Hey, what's up guys? This is Peter from MSI, and these are the five things you need to know about the GeForce GTX 1080 Ti Lightning Z. Number one, overclocking. MSI Lightning graphics cards are built for extreme overclocking using liquid nitrogen for breaking world records. This 1080 Ti Lightning is no exception. It has three 8-pin power connectors, 18 power phases, a dual BIOS, and V checkpoints for external voltage monitoring. Number two, gaming. Besides overclocking, the Lightning graphics cards are also excellent for gaming. Thanks to higher out of the box clock speeds and the Trifrozer thermal design, which is the biggest and best cooling that we use and is easily able to keep the beastly GTX 1080 Ti GPU cool under load. This means stable in-game performance without any frame drops for you. Number three, Trifrozer. The Trifrozer thermal design uses three MSI Torx 2.0 fans with ball bearings that deliver great airflow and will outlast the card. At the heart of the massive heatsink is a nickel plated copper base plate that connects directly to the GPU to catch all the heat and transfer it efficiently to the six heat pipes that run through the heatsink. Number four, cooling innovations. We featured some brand new cooling innovations on our GTX 1080 Ti Lightning Z to help keep it cool. There are heat pipes infused into the back plate and the close quarters heatsink that helps to cool the power delivery components and the memory modules. Number five, design. The outside of the new Lightning Z looks quite impressive, but we've also included some premium inlays for you so that you can customize these silver design elements into either red, gold, or carbon to match your rig. And last but not least, the card has some beautiful Mystic Light RGB effects, as you can see on the side and on the back plate. So you can customize colors and effects and synchronize them with other RGB components in your system for an astonishing display. So now you know the five most important things about the new Lightning Z. Thanks for watching.